Hello everyone, my name is Haven, and today I'm playing a demo of an indie game, which apparently is on Steam and I did not know of, called Psych. Uh, I have no idea what this game is about, as most games I don't know, well, some games I do know, but of most indie horror games that I do not know of. Uh, most of my games that I honestly do, like, ones that I do find are usually ones that I find on itch.io and I just kind of look and see oh if this looks good or not or you know whatever just I just look at games that I think would be interesting so I figured this one would be interesting so with that being said let's jump right into this and see how interesting this game is how many times can I say interesting in a minute probably a lot how many times did I say it in one minute though tell me in the comments it's now been a whole year since I've seen my family. After the accident, I was in hospital for a very long time. However, there was none nearby, so I had to be placed in one in the next town. Unfortunately, I can't remember the accident either, and I only know that I drove off the road in a car. And because of this accident, I developed a behavioural disorder. More precisely, a post-traumatic stress disorder which made me imagine things and caused me to behave uncontrollably. So I was transferred from the hospital directly to the nearest clinic for mentally disturbed people. No visitors were allowed there. Not even my own family. It took me almost the whole year to deal with the behavioural disorder, and even now it isn't normal. So I'll probably have to live with it until further notice. They didn't want to talk to me about the exact causes and said that such disorders can often occur in such accidents. Anyway, the day after tomorrow is my little sister Sam's birthday. She'll be 16. So, I thought that on the day of my release, I would meet Sam directly and we would go to our parents' house to celebrate her birthday. She called me right after my release and said that she'd found a park nearby where we can meet. It's already quite late. So I have to hurry. Alright, so we are at the park. Oh, a new message. Oh, really? From Sam, perhaps? Perhaps. Uh, our message. Gonna be there soon. Great, can't wait, Alex. Hey, Alex, I'm waiting at the phone booth near the pond. Just go left when you come here from the entrance. Alright, cool. Right. Okay. So this way, right? I already don't know where I'm going. Wait. Let's go left. Okay. So I'll just make sure. I am stupid. Okay. I am stupid. I'm not saying that like, to degrade myself. I'm just saying I literally read that, <laughs> and for some reason. Did not comprehend what that meant. So this is an interesting view. I like the way it looks so far. It's very pretty. Like graphically, it feels right. Is the ringing coming from the phone booth? Might be. How about we go take a look? Ah! My head! What is this pain? So many. I don't think anybody hit, in this, hit us in the back of the head, so I don't know. Uh, 80s party night. Interesting. Chess club tournament. I have... Whoa, sir. I have your sister. Come to the other side of the pond, take a seat, and let's talk a bit. Who what? are you? Oh, Sam? I want to see. Join the abstinence. No. 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 Ah, my legs suddenly hurt so much. Oh, suddenly we can't run. <laughs> okay, nothing in the trash. I'm sorry, Sam. Apparently my legs have given up on me. Oh, it's police tape. That's not nice. That's not good. Uh, was I supposed to come to the pond? Or go around the pond? I don't know. I can't. Okay, where am I going? Was I supposed to just sit down? I don't... I don't 
don't get it. What am I doing? What am I supposed to be doing? Uh, was I supposed to go this way? Alright, let's go back to the phone booth. But clearly, I did something wrong. Odd. Okay. I'm, I'm just, I'm already having a hard time explaining, or er, understanding instructions. It's, it's, it's terrible. Come to the other side of the pond, take a seat. Okay, I got that. Now, I, I, I just tried to take a seat. Right, let's try this again. No, not that way. Maybe I have to. Maybe I was supposed to hit E or something. No? Okay, I am at said pond. Right? I am at said sea. Now, unless he's talking about over there, then yeah, I might, I might need to go. Let's go try it. I mean, maybe, maybe I was supposed to. I thought it was right there. I mean, you'd think it's so obvious. Not here. Maybe I can't go this way. Okay. Oh. Hey, 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 wait, come here, come here. Oh, you're gone. Damn it. Uh, can I crouch? Is it really? That's that's my my level of crouching. Okay. Um. I'm clearly missing something here. Yeah, I don't know what is what's going on. <laughs> it's like for real. Uh, I seem to not. I, hold on. I am at the bench. No, okay. And I can't... I can't go under there. I can't run. Ugh. This is already going off to a bad start. I know how to play games. I promise. But I can't go that way. The only other thing I can think of... Let's follow... Pond, if it'll let us. Oh! Wait. I'm an idiot. Maybe? Right here. Okay. I thought so. Missing person disclosure. According to the new report, Emily, a married woman, was last seen with her husband Paul and her son Jack in the park near the clinic. Mentally disturbed people. According to witnesses, Emily often also often went to the park alone at night to sing near the pond. When it went, witness asked her why she sang there. Okay, see, this is getting too... To, uh, never mind. Uh, saying there, she replied that it calmed her down after every argument with her husband. In view of this, her husband dis disappeared with her son without a trace. The husband is under investigation. If you have any clues or information, please come to the local Wine Vale police station or contact us using the contact information below. Uh... Safety courses, great offers. Yeah, nobody cares. All right, what do you, what do you have now, my brother? Take a seat. Okay, you're gonna bop me in the back of the head. Boy, this would be scary. Hello, who's there? I'm just... What the hell is this? What's going on here? Was that just a joke from Sam? If so, this is anything but funny, Sam. Yes, Sam. Feels like a little mud blood. You? I'm losing patience. I'm getting up, Sam. If you turn around, I'll pull the trigger. Are we quiet now? Good boy. Listen to me carefully. Your sweet little sister, Sam, has stolen something that doesn't belong to her. Something of immeasurable value. Well, whatever it is, I don't have it. 
We took her to a safe place. She says she hid it. Here, in the park. And wrote a puzzle for it. It just seems so weird. What? What kind of puzzle? What are you talking about? The puzzle is... Okay. Ring ring. My head. Where am I? The park. He woke up just in time. You have exactly 15 minutes before the drug takes effect. A drug? Why did you do that? What, what is going on here? Well... I gave you a drug that was supposed to kill you after one hour. You've been out now for... exactly 42 minutes. It takes three minutes for the drugs to take effect. So... you have 15 minutes left. Convenient. Before you start to feel the side effects. What the fuck did you do that for? You fucking... Now, now. You still have a chance to save yourself and your thieving little sister. I've hidden an antidote in a box. Sealed with a code. Your first clue to the code is by the phone box. Good luck. Alright. Cool. Fucking hell. This can't be happening. Can I get up? Okay. And I guess I can't run to the phone box. Okay. What does this have to do with me? I mean, yeah, I, I get it, shit, my sister. But why go through the trouble of doing all this? Okay, I'm a murderer, Emily. I'm a goddamn murderer, and I'm so fucking sorry. I didn't mean it. I really didn't mean it. Please believe me. I was so, so pissed that you kept this from me. And when I came to you, you were already... My God, Emily. I'm so fucking sorry. I know I can never make it up to you, but... I promise I will take care of Jack with all my strength. I'm such a bad father. Such a goddamn bad father. Now Jack will have to grow up without a mother, and it's all because of me. I wish, even though I knew it won't happen... I know it won't happen. That we will see each other again in the next life. Hope you are well in heaven. Husband Paul. Sad. I wish there was a counter. <laughs> that was just random. Out of blue. Okay, he said it was right next. Now I'm thinking, it's either this or the highway. Uh, if you add up the first two digits of the American emergency call, uh, what do you get? Oh. What is the American? Wait. Oh, 9 1. Oh, so it'd be 10 then, right? Okay, no. Right? If you add up the first two digits of the American emergency call, what do you get? So it's 9 1, that'd be 10. Uh. do the call. I don't know. I had somebody knock. <laughs> so crazy. Right. It said it has to be nine and yeah, nine and one. You add them up. Nine plus ten. Right? That should be it. Right there. I don't know. I guess I'm just supposed to push 911. The number you have reached has been changed. Okay, I'll just do 911. The number you have reached has been changed. Get it. If you add up the, the first two digits of the emergency call. If you add up the first two digits. Now what does that mean? If you add up the first two digits of the American emergency call, what do you get? Call. Oh, 10, 109, okay. Or no, 101, I think would be it. Right. Maybe, maybe I'm wrong.
These are the first three of four digits to the code. Hurry up. 101. Oh, hello there. The entrance. The entrance. Now hurry up. Uh, the entrance, okay. Alright, hey Alex, I'm waiting on the phone booth near the pond. Oh, yeah. Where the heck are you? I'm at the pond near the construction site. Please hurry up. Okay. That doesn't add up. Um, this is the entrance, right? So, 101. Did I come in a van? I don't think I came in a van, did I? I figured not. So inconsiderate. Why is this place blocked off? How do I get out? I was gonna say, how do I get out? 101. Human being is infinite in its value. What does that mean? Because that does not explain a damn thing. What does it mean by infinite? I guess. It's gotta be an additional number, right? I'm trying to think. Um human being is infinite in its value. What does that mean? I mean, we might as well try. Just produce another poison. Uh, God. Uh, Sam, I have to find Sam. All right, let's go find her. Your sister's caused a lot of trouble. What the? Now I wonder why it's called Psych. Because the I went the Psych. Like, I, I don't know. I, I'm thinking psychic or psyche. I don't know. It's, I think it's something more to it. What's happening? You are controlling the lights. The hash slinging slasher. Is, it, is, it, is this funny? Are you, are you laughing? Only you can see my face. Like, I'm so deadpan right now. It's so real. It's so surreal. I think this is the This should be the construction site, right? I want to make sure. Okay, yeah. She said she was at the construction site, so. I imagine we gotta go this way. Uh, 
Okay. Now, there's only one other way I think I think I can go. And I'm about to try that way. Tape is up over here, then I don't I don't know what to do. <laughs> Okay, the tape is up. Oh, but you weren't there, ah. there before. Oh, my head. Okay. I, okay, I'm not Jesus. I can't walk on water. Uh, let's construction the site. You know, it's been 20 minutes. I should have died. I should be dead right now. There is a note in the trees over here. I did not see that before. Okay. He sees me, although he has no eyes. He follows me, although he no, does not know me. He wants me, although I have nothing to do with him. VS. Who is VS? Oh. So it's gonna be like that. I got like major Slenderman vibes after that. <laughs> Alright. Okay. Damn it, where am I supposed to go? I know I'm supposed to go like I mean obviously I'm supposed to go find this find we're supposed to find our sister. But damn it, man, like, give me a hint or something. Maybe there's like a crack in the wall or something. No, my luck, that would be it right there. Like, you know, crack in the wall or. Oh, I don't have a flashlight, do I? Oh, maybe that is my flashlight. This is a very confusing demo. I need help. This user needs help. I'm so confused. Maybe I'm just tired. That's why. Is that a... What the hell? I... No. I don't want anything to do with this. God damn it. No. I don't know what I saw. What did I see? Oh. Wow, see, this is what I'm talking about. There's no, like, real visual cues. Okay. Now, what would... See, this is what I'm talking about. Okay. Uh, learning messages. Let's see. There's no flashlight button on this side, no. There's no indication of, like, okay, what to do next. That's what I'm talking about. Okay, so maybe, let's say he sees the body. Okay, so he sees the body. What would be the next move? Like, this, this is, like, more of an investigative thing at this point. Like, what would I need to do next? Bug here, sorry. It's a bug. Okay, so... Maybe... My next move. Okay, maybe follow the flashlight. Okay. That would be appropriate, right? Are you looking for me, Alex? Whoa. Ah, oh, son of a bitch. <laughs> what a demo. Oh, it took me. That took a while, and I only say that because it's like. Damn, man. That's crazy. So, that was psych. My only issue with this game. Actually, there's quite a couple of. One, 
I felt like that this demo didn't really elaborate too much. Maybe that, that, that was the point. It's to get you hooked. And maybe I might just game the future. But here's my whole thing. If the game's not already out, here's, here's my whole thing. I had no idea where I was going, what I was looking for. Really, I think with this one, there needs to be some kind of indication. Somehow. I mean, it's called psych. So maybe, I don't know, maybe psychic ability or something. If that's what the game's going up. I'm not, I'm not entirely sure. I know this guy was complaining about his head hurting. That's as far as it went with that. But, like, I had no idea where I was going. I was like, okay, well, maybe, maybe I gotta go this way. Because, you know, you get a text message saying, oh, I'm over here at the construction site. And I'm like, okay, maybe I gotta go to the construction site. And I can't go to it because there's uh, caution tape there. And I'm like, okay, I clearly can't go under that. So what am I supposed to, what was I supposed to, and I just got lost. I got so confused, as you can see. I was like, where am I going? What am I doing? Like, I almost wanted, you know, at some, at one point, I was just like, maybe I should just stop playing because I'm not, I can't figure out what's going on because I have no idea what the games want me to do next. I mean, I wish I could, I think what would have maybe made it better is if I was able to run at least, or at least speed walk or something. Because of walking so slow, I'm like, well, maybe I gotta be over here. Okay, let me spend ten minutes walking that way. Okay, it's not over here. Well, maybe it's maybe it's back at the the area I was just at, and maybe I just missed it. Now I gotta take another ten minutes to go back over, you know. And it just it just took way too long to get where I needed to go. I get that the the walking aspect of it was just there for pacing wise, you know, the to extend the length of the demo because you know most games do that they'll slow. Sometimes they'll make you walk so that you can really feel the length of the game, you know, or the, the length of it, you know, like you really are taking time instead of just rushing through. So I, I get that. And I, I, I completely understand that. But for this, I was kind of just like, uh, where is everything? I got, I guess I got to spend 20 minutes finding something that probably would have been a little bit easier if it said, hey, go to this area and go to that area. And I mean, I like the first part of the game, I was, I, I don't know, maybe I was just dead inside, so I couldn't understand what was going on. But once I started to try to understand, I was like, okay, what is going on here? Like, where is everything? And I was genuinely confused. So maybe, maybe these issues will, could potentially be addressed. Maybe not, maybe, you know, just leave it in there. I mean, after all, this game, you know, my opinion, this shouldn't really affect your creative um, design for the game, like how you want it to be. You know, this is your game, not mine. I'm not going to tell you how to do it. I'm just here to you know, play it and see if I like it or not. You know? and I'm, I'll give suggestions, and if you take the suggestions, awesome. Not, hey, it is what it is. I mean, I, I enjoyed it, what I, little I did. I was intrigued. I was kind of curious. But, you know, I think the one thing that will, you know, the, the couple of things that I've talked about, maybe if they were implemented, if anything, just at least some form of help, I think I could get a little bit more invested in it, you know. But with that, if you guys want to play it for yourself, I'll put it in the comment, or not the comments, but I'll put it in the description below. And if you guys enjoy this video, like, comment, subscribe, you know, let me know what you want to see. You know, did you enjoy the uh, video? Did you want to see me play something else? Let me know. Give me ideas, you know, because there's only so many indie games in the world. And I would like to be able to play them all, if anything. At least I want to play the good ones, not the bad ones. Not the ones that are, like, broken or half-assed, you know. Give me give me some good ones. Show me something that's scary. So, with that, uh, hope you guys have a wonderful day.